Hey y'all, it's Amanda with Tap Mom and the Big Brigade. Welcome back to my channel. This is Mornings with Jesus, our daily devotional. And this one is for Thursday, October 31st. And it starts with a Bible verse and goes as follows. Never stop praying, especially for others. Always pray by the power of the Spirit. Stay alert and keep praying for God's people. Ephesians 6 verse 18. Now our inspirational story. I often chat with a co-worker about what's going on in our lives. One morning, a friend shared with me that his brother was going through some health and personal struggles. I asked his brother's name, and he told me it was Paul. Okay, I said, I'll be praying for Paul. About a week later, I inquired about my colleague's sibling. Hey, how's Paul doing? I asked. My co-worker promptly gave me an update and assured me that his brother was making progress. Thanks for praying for him, he said, and thanks for asking about him by name. It struck me in that moment what an encouragement it was to my friend to know that I had prayed for his loved one and had called out his, na his name to Jesus. The Apostle Paul instructed the church of Eph Ephesus never to stop praying for others. There are so many people I strive to remember and pray for by name, family and friends, co-workers and neighbors, and even people I hear about in daily newscast are those I pray for. Some stand in need of healing, others need encouragement or guidance, and still others need financial blessings or strength to keep pushing onward. Of course, Jesus knows who they are and what they need, but it certainly doesn't hurt to tell him. In fact, that's what we are called to do. Brenda, uh, Barbara Lumpkins Walls. Faith step, list at least three people you want to remember as you pray today. Be sure to call out their names and specific request to Jesus and let them know that you are praying for them. Well, I do that all the time. I hope y'all do too. And I hope y'all enjoyed this one. Please remember that I love you and so does Jesus. And I'll see y'all in the next one. Bye now.